So, EA just dropped a guaranteed what if player SBC, and we're going to open a bunch of them and see if they are good. For cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description, and use the code HABER to get yourself a discount on all of your orders. It's an 85 rated squad with 30 chemistry to get a guaranteed what if player. Now, you've got players like Sancho, Richarlison. Gomez, Kante, etc. Let's see if we can get something good. This is my account, and then we're going to open up the ones on SharePlay as well. See what you guys can get. So here we go. On my account, it's going to be... I've got a lot on tradable as well, so hopefully I don't get a dupe here. It's going to be Portuguese, centre-back, Pepe. Eh, it's okay. It's not It's not garbage. It's not great. Uh, probably worth a lot less than the pack. Um, however, one clean sheet, and it gets a plus two. It's not the worst card in the world. In terms of value, probably not worth a whole lot. Um, but it's not the worst card in the world. Uh, I am going to quickly check what this card is worth on Footbin and see if he's uh, if he's worth over 100k. I'll take it. He's worth 60k. That's a big L. That's a huge L. Right. Hopefully, you guys get pa better pack look than I do. Um, as as my chat is saying, that is the worst one you can get. All right. Finley's guaranteed. What if player next? Can we get Finley something good? Here we go. Can we get Finley a win? Hopefully, he's better than Pepe. Portuguese ain't bad because Ricardo Pereira is a good player, in my opinion. That's why Portuguese wasn't too bad. I was quite excited for it. But here we go. With Finley's, it's going to be Argentina. Oh, it's Pereira. He was worth about 100k. Is he still worth around that? Um, What is Pereira worth? Chat saying L. 87k. Mm, not great, is it? Not the worst, because it's a good usable card. It's just not the greatest. That's the unfortunate nature of it. Price-wise, a bit of an L, but usability-wise, good card, in my opinion. All right, Jake's now. Jake's foot what if card. Foot what if pack, sorry. Here we go. What are we getting for Jake? Can we get him something good? It is going to be Portuguese right back. Oh, it's Pepe again. I have a weird feeling. Three packs in. This might be like the guaranteed Pereira and Pepe pack. Um, I have a, I have a feeling it might be the guaranteed what if Pereira and Pepe. Hopefully I'm wrong. It just, it, it's got that vibe and I hope that it doesn't continue like that, but it's got that vibe. All right, Lou's pack now. Here we go. Can Lou get something good? Hopefully it's not Pereira or Pepe. Oh, we've got speed up lag in the menus. This is a first for FIFA. It's going to be Serbian. Who is this? Jovic. That's not bad. That's pretty decent. I actually don't know what this card's worth, but I think that's pretty good. Frankfurt definitely have the potential to get the, I think, six goals needed. Um, this card's worth... Wow, it's under 100k. These cards have dropped significantly. I thought he was still about 200k. That's not great, unfortunately. Not terrible, but not great. All right, next one. This is Ben's pack now. Can we get Ben something good? Come on, Brazil? England? French? It is Brazil striker. Center back, Marcelo. I kind of forgot he existed. Um... I think he's... I, I'm pretty sure he is confirmed to get an upgrade. So that will be a 90 rated card. Um, Price-wise, the card's at about 90,000 coins. Not the worst, but not great. Hippo's pack now. Can Hippo get something good? For Ealing Villa FC. Here we go. Come on, Hippo. Let's get him something good, please. Let's get a big win. Come on. Get one early in the video. Portuguese right back. The guaranteed Pepe pack prevails again. God, the guaranteed Pepe pack. Interestingly enough, fun fact, Pepe's never had a card on FIFA with over 80 pace. Fun fact, in all of his years of FIFA. Interesting. All right, we have got Ziggy's pack now. The lights have just been turned on as well. I didn't realize they weren't on before. Here we go. Would the lights bring a dub? That's the question. It's going to be Argentina Cam. It's another Pereira. It's the guaranteed Pereira and Pepe pack right now. Um, with the amount of what ifs that are currently out, the fact that we've opened like what five or six of them, and it's been like the same two players bar one is kind of a bit stinky. Hopefully that gets changed, but that's you know it's a bit stupid, isn't it? All right, next one. He's called it the scam pack. He called it the scam what if pack, the guaranteed Portuguese scam pack, or the guaranteed well, it's guaranteed Portuguese centre back or the guaranteed Argentine left mid, realistically. Um, but yeah, Pereira is a good card. It's just that it's not worth a whole lot, really. All right, come on. Can we get someone decent here, please? Spain? Go on. Reguillon. Yubo Chiche is still decent. That's a good one. That is a guaranteed upgrade as well, I'm pretty sure. 
which is going to be an 89 rated card with about 86 defending, 89 physicals, 85 dribbling. That's going to be a really nice card, to be fair. Him and Regulion will both be nice left backs. I think both guaranteed upgrades, so that is a solid one. I think Spain is one of the, for once, a, a nation you actually want to see in one of these packs. Kai's pack next. Come on, Kai. Let's get you something good here. Please, EA. Get Kai something decent. What are we getting in this guaranteed what if pack? Italian? Left mid? Griffo? I'm pretty sure value wise it's not a great card, but the card itself looks alright. 86 rated. Um, with an upgrade would be a pretty nice card. Four star, four star in game. In game stats are actually nice as well. Price wise, not great, but the actual card itself will probably play pretty well in game with an upgrade. So that's not too bad. The foot what if speller. Here we go. Come on. Spain is the one we want to see here, realistically. Spain striker or left back is what we want to see. Brazil striker. Lucas Leiva. Okay. That's not too bad. Um, What's this card worth? Lucas Leiva. Oops, I've misspelled him. Uh, On the market, it's currently worth about 88k. Yeah, again, not great. But with an upgrade will be a nice card. I think that an upgrade over 80 pace, 89 defending, 89 physical, that'd be a very nice card. Next one. The Road to Glory FC. Go on. Show us the love. Show us the love, EA. Right here. Not seen an Odegaard or anything like that. Right back. We're back to Pepe. Hey, we got we got like two packs clear, man. We we got we got like two packs clear before we were back to Pepe again. So that's 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 a big win in my opinion. Two packs without Pepe is, is a win. Next pack. Come on. In honor of United winning 2-0 today. Can we get ourselves a big player here, please? A big player. It's gonna be French. Ah, it's Lee Malou. It's not too bad. It's not great though. Like, it's uh it's one of those cards that without an upgrade is 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 significantly worse than with an upgrade, right? With an upgrade. It, it's going to be, I think, a very nice center mid. But without an upgrade, it's a bit, bit rubbish. All right, next one. We're, we're going through these quickly. It's just that we're not really coming away with, with big victories. Um, this one's going to be... Not odd. Diata. Okay, it's a card that's not worth a whole lot, but has got really nice stats yet again. I don't actually know exactly how much the card is worth. But it's one of those that has really nice stats. Oh, that card's actually worth 170k. Wait, what? I honestly didn't think he'd be worth that much. I, he's got great stats, so he deserves to be worth that much. But that's fantastic. We'll take that. The first actual big win of the video. Let's go. Okay, next pack. Orlando's pack. Salta FC. Bring home the dub for us, please. Please, Salta FC. All right, here we go. Come on, Salta. Come on, Orlando. Bring it home. Bring it home. It's going to be Portuguese right back. No! So many Pepe's! So many Pepe's! <sighs> the next Foot What If Speller. What are we getting in this Foot What If Speller? Come on. Be someone good, please. It's going to be... Is that another Diata? You take that. That's not bad. EA finally added in Diata. I think every 10 minutes that goes by, EA are adding a new player to these packs. So, started off with just Pepe. Then they added in Pereira. Then they added in Jovic. Now they've added in uh, Diata. So that's a, that's a win though. That's good. Carter's foot what if pack now. Can we get Carter something good here, please? Can we can we bring home the dub for Carter? Last two have been Pepe and Diata. Diata's nice though. Brazil, striker. Oh, it's another Marcelo. It's another Marcelo. L. O. No, it doesn't work at all. But again, like it's just another card that whilst... He's not got an upgrade. He's behind the power curve. But I'm pretty sure he's guaranteed an upgrade. So it should be an alright card when he does get the upgrade. But as of right now, it's not what you want to see. Alright, next what if pack. He's Danish. Are there any Danish what ifs? I don't think there is. Uh, I guess Norwegian will do. So an Odegaard, because he's got the Arsenal banners, wouldn't be too bad. Wouldn't be too bad at all. It's getting a bit boring now, isn't it? It's just getting a little bit boring. It's getting a little bit boring. Seeing the same players over and over again. Can we get uh, can we get some new players in here, please, EA? Can we get some new faces? That'd be nice. Totally forgot Daniel Vass is Danish. And he is in team two. My brain went completely. Come on, let's see Belgium. Let's see French CDM, you know? Let's see Brazilian striker. Let's see Spanish striker. Or let's see Italian left mid. In Griffo. Nice. Uh, okay. 
Thank you very much, EA. Just boring me a bit now. All right, Thibs pack now. Thibs pack look is pretty insane. So if we're going to get someone something good, I feel like it's Thibs. His pack look is pretty nuts. Although he's a Spurs fan. So I won't be angry if you don't give him something good. Can't lie. If that was Region, that would have been so perfect. Ryubu GJ is not bad, but Region would have been so perfect for Thibs. Because that's the only Spurs player. Um, that's not bad, though. That isn't terrible, to be fair. All right, Nico's pack now. I like when the pack's in a different language because if it's one of those... Uh, if it's one of the nations that's got multiple uh, players, you don't know which one you've got, you know? That's why I like it. Here we go. It's going to be Spanish. DFI. Oh, Region! Let's go! That's sick. Did Spurs get a clean sheet today? I feel like they did. I don't know 100%, but what's Region worth? 240k. That is a big win. That's a nice left back card, man. If you've got a Premier League left side, he'll be in your team probably until at least team of the season. That's class. All right, next one. Class on grass. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. It's going to be Brazil again. Another Marcelo. Another Marcelo. That's fun. That's really fun. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Here we go. Here we go. What are we getting? In this next one. Portuguese right back. Ah! 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 Yay! Stop it, man. Another foot F what a player now for vanity. Go on. English right mid. Jaden Sancho. That'd be very nice. It's going to be... Hopefully not Pepe. Please. This might be the worst weighted SBC that we've had in months. I don't remember the last time we got an SBC weighted this poorly. To the point where it's literally the same trash player constantly over and over and over and over again. My word. All right, next one. Next one. Come on, EA. Please, man. <laughs> I can't do the Pepe. I don't know what I'll do if I get it. it. Mate, this is just so, so bad. Spanish striker. Left back, Reguillon. Reguillon, thank you. I've had so many Pepes now. Finally, a Reguillon. Another one. That's nice. We'll take that. That relieves a bit of the Pepe stress. Because that Pepe stress was starting to build. Finally. Come on. All right, next one. Here we go. Come on. Please. Another another card on the on the on the level of Reggion would be nice. We'll take it. The out is a win. Good value. Good card as well. Um, people in chat saying this is like the FIFA 21 Ryan Kent. So we'll take that. Solid. Mike's now. Mike packed. Mid Hullet today. So if he gets anything, anything at all, it's undeserved. It's not deserved if he gets anything at all. Okay? All right? He's got Diata. That's actually really good again. <laughs> I tell you what, when your pack looks on, your pack looks on. And that is a really, really good pack right there. GG's on that. All right. Kai Chief was Ricardo Pereira. He's a big Leicester City fan. Can he get Ricardo Pereira? Come on, EA, please. Just for once. Portuguese, but not Pepe. Please. <laughs> eh. I'll take that. It's not too bad. Yuri Baby Cheetah's all right. The wrong fullback, but still not bad. Still pretty decent. Next one. Here we go. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. Here we go. <laughs> what are we saying? What are we saying? Diata again. This guaranteed Pepe and Diata with a tiny bit of Pereira, tiny bit of Lima Lu, tiny bit of, you know, Yuri Berry, GJ and Reguillon, but mainly just Diata and Pepe now. All right, next one. He's put in flashback El Shadarwe. He put in flashback El Shadarwe for this. Can it pay out, please? Brazilian striker. CDM. It's all right. Not great. The, the unfortunate thing is, 
guess a link. Guess a soft link to El Shadar way as well. Oh, that's a big L. That is a big L. All right, anyone but Jaden Sancho. That's the only card he's got untradeable right now. Anyone but Jaden Sancho here, please. Imagine this is Jaden Sancho now. Brazil. CDM. Lucas Leiva. I like it. Fair enough. Fair play. Um, not the worst, not the best. It is fair play. You know, it's all right. It's not terrible. You know what I mean? It's all right. Neds now. Go on. Anyone but Pereira. He's already got Pereira. Anyone but Pereira. Anyone but a left mid is what I should have said, really. Because you don't want another left mid when you've already got a left mid. You know what I mean? <sighs> All right. Come on. The penultimate one for the video. Can we get something good here? I have no idea how many we've opened so far. We've opened a lot, though. And we're yet to get one of the big dogs. Can this be it? Ah! <sighs> No, it can't. It's another Grifo. Oh, that's Spain without the S. Champagne without the Sham. And just pain in general, really. There's pack number 35 for the video. And the last one for the video, Mike wants Sancho. I predict we're going to end on Pepe. It would be poetic to end on Pepe. Here we go. What are we ending it on? Brazil centre-back Marcelo. Out of 35 of these packs, I think we've genuinely had about seven different players or six different players. It's just been, it's been six of the same players constantly. Like, there's been, it's just been the same pool of players. It's frustrating because these are what packs used to be like at FIFA 20. And at FIFA 21, we've had a lot more of a spread of players that we've had in these videos. And we're right back to getting the same players over and over and over again, which is frustrating, but... It's just EA, isn't it? So, thank you all for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you are new around here. And I'll see you later.